right. All right. Here are the here are the volcanic activity we're talking about. Okay, about eight or nine. Um, again, more than usual. But La Palma is the one we're watching. Okay, so let me bump into La Palma. <laughs> oh yeah, one of those days. All right. Um, but this is uh, when I zoom in on this. This is going to trip you guys out. Okay. Now I don't know if this is related to sensors on the island. Notice, just notice the spread. All right. And these are volcanoes. Notice the spread. Are you seeing this? What in the world is going on there? All right. Now, um, now this is a European um, volcanic or, or uh, sorry, earthquake uh, EMSC is what it's called. These are spaced perfectly across this thing. Now, I'm going to play devil's advocate for a second. Could this be where the sensors are located and they're picking them up and it's just so precise that these are they're spaced exactly across there, the sensors? Maybe. Maybe. And it's just showing that. But maybe not, okay? Uh, one of those things that makes you step back and go, hmm, this is really, really odd. That, folks, is almost, I mean, they are, you take a tape measure to that or a, a ruler on your screen and I guarantee they are exactly spaced all the way around the grid okay all right now that's the La Palma piece uh, and that <laughs> that all right now I'm gonna be quiet for a second and uh, I want you to see this and then I will come back to the right screen I promise mm -hmm. check this out now this is from uh, 2019 okay um, it came from a uh, sorry 2009 and it came out of a video game called Secret Files 2 uh, Puritus Cordis, okay, and uh, this is a trip. Now, this is your Trump down the escalator uh, thing, okay? Check this out. Here we go. This is La Palma, one of the Canary Islands, a paradise for sun-loving tourists. For us, the island holds quite another fascination, the Hombre Vieja Volcano. The brittle western slope of the volcano is covered in clefts and fissures where water has collected. And now for the interesting part. By placing several bombs in carefully calculated slots, we can use thermonuclear explosions to heat that water so that it will evaporate instantaneously. If you had paid attention in your physics classes, you would know that such a sudden evaporation of water would create sufficient pressure to shatter the volcano's brittle slope and send it crashing into the sea. Can you guess what comes next? That's right, a tsunami. Waves 200 meters high will charge across the Atlantic with the speed of an airplane. The tsunami will sweep across the east coast of the United States. New York will disappear in an apocalyptic flood, taking with it the self-proclaimed rulers of the world who are currently squabbling in blind incompetence at the UN headquarters. The resulting vacuum of power will be filled by our followers, some of whom have been biding their time in key positions for decades. They will take control and lead humankind to a new golden age. My button magic again as I hit the wrong button. Okay. That, if that doesn't make you go, hmm, right there, 2009, all right? Uh, and then we see this grid on here. I'm just telling you, this is stuff you can't make up. It's absolutely crazy.